I mentioned in the unboxing of the Fujimi kit for the Mercedes Evo 2 that I will be using a different body and that body is from Skill Production. They made this up after they saw a rendering for the touring wagon of that Evolution and thought it was really cool so they produced the body and sent me one free of charge to build for you guys. So as you can see this is not a simple add-on to the body, this is just an entire replacement for the body. They made it a lot easier so you don't really have to cut anything. They extended the roof and added that rear section to make it into the touring and also added some of their emblems in it and cast a perfect copy of that body with their changes to it. Every single detail that was on the original body was captured and transferred to the molded piece you see here in pure perfection. I could only find one small air bubble and that was on the underside of the hood so I didn't really have to worry about that anyway. All the body parts are in the kit which you need and that is pretty much only the body and some parts for the interior and also the rear windows which are now of course extended longer than the other ones from the stock kit so they supplied some vacuum formed parts for that as well. They also included a roof rail if you so desire to put those on. They have a couple of spares in order for you to either put a roof box on it or something else or just the roof rail. In the unboxing of the original Fujimi kit you could see that there was no rear seat or headrests for that rear seat. It was just completely removed and changed for some race car parts. Now of course if you're going to build this you're probably going to build it in a stock-ish road car style version to make it into the ultimate street sleeper or the ultimate dad wagon of course. So Scale Production made a rear bench seat with some separate headrests to fully detail that interior out. 